Hi, I'm Ethan. I love mods loading, and this is some scenes from the 2023 NMLRA Spring National Shoot. Unfortunately, I was pulled away a little bit early from the shoot, so I don't have as much coverage from the event that I would have liked to have had, but I wanted to get this video out in time to talk a little bit about the Fall National Championship shoot here that's coming up in September. Coming up here in the second weekend of September in 2023, just as many of the NMLRA national events are either in the second weekend of June or the second weekend of September, much of what you see in this video is coming up, and I want you to consider planning for a trip to Friendship, Indiana, to the home of the National Muzzleloading Rifle Association to see and participate in some of these great muzzleloading activities. Even if you're not interested in the championship competition side of things, I wanna tell you that if you have even a passing interest in muzzleloading and wanna learn more about it, this is a great event to go to and learn from and even take your first shots with a muzzleloader. You can visit the clubhouse on the modern side or the blockhouse on the primitive or living history side of the NMLRA grounds and talk to a range officer that can guide you through or direct you to a volunteer that will guide you through your first shot with a muzzle loading arm. Um, and I just, I bring this up because we're heading into, I think a good time to plan to make a visit to this event. I hear a lot about people wanting to get into muzzleloading, not knowing where to start. If you are in the area of Friendship, Indiana, um, it's about an hour from Cincinnati, uh, it's a couple hours from Lexington, Kentucky. If you're in that region, this is a great place to go and really get a shot in the arm uh, for pa your passion and your education when it comes to muzzleloading. Commercial Row has a variety of vendors and craftspeople that are you know, offering wares and supplies um, to get you started, as well as um, on the primitive side or the living history side, there's gonna be a ton of vendors and craftspeople as well to help you get kitted out in your muzzleloading supplies. As I said earlier, if you're not interested in the championship competition side of things, there's a variety of things that you can do and have fun with too, apart from that kind of hardcore muzzleloading competition. But I encourage you, if you are interested in competitive shooting, or even in uh, if you're just focused on modern arms, you know some some of the tactical or or practical shooting sports that are out there, give the muzzleloading competition scene a try. There's a lot of neat. Um, disciplines out there, I think, for you to try. And you can see all of them on display at an NMLRA national championship like this. There's um, several woods walks. There's a knife and tomahawk woods walk now that looks like a lot of fun. There's the primitive side that has a lot of matches focusing on historic events or 18th and 19th century practical shooting, as uh, I kind of jokingly call it. But then on the other side of the creek on the main NMLRA range, you have everything from um, you know, traditional early 20th century chunk and over the log shooting to long range black powder cartridge and long range muzzle loading, precision shooting, offhand shooting. Um, you have muzzle loading pistol disciplines from flintlock to cap lock and revolver, modern and traditional. And then you have trap, skeet, and sporting clays for your muzzle loading shotguns, as well as an interactive quail walk for you to go through with your muzzle loading shotguns. I can't name every range and every discipline. I don't want this to sound like an ad, um, but I really just do want to share that this event is coming up. Um, and I hope to be there a little bit longer here in September. So if you're at the range, you're at the NMLRA National Championship, uh, look me up. I hope to be traveling through, doing some interviews and, and capturing some, some muzzleloading history and some passion for muzzleloading because the grounds are just overflowing with it here uh, coming up in September. Really quick, I want to say if you're going to be at the Fall National Shoot here coming up in uh, September of 2023, depending on when you're watching this video, and you would be willing to come on camera to talk about your passion for muzzleloading, talk about what you do on the competitive side of muzzleloading, or give any tips to some of your beginners here on the I Love Muzzleloading channel, please reach out and let me know. I'm trying to gather a catalog of folks that are willing to come on camera and, and talk a little bit about their passion for muzzleloading here, just to give some people an idea of, of what brings people into muzzleloading. Uh, we get a lot of what I'm interested in here on the channel, and I'd love to show a little bit more of the variety that's out there in muzzleloading. So if you're interested in that kind of thing, you're interested in talking a little bit about something you're passionate about in muzzleloading, please reach out and let me know before the event and we'll schedule some time 
during the shoot. That's all, all I've got for you this week. I hope to see you at the NMLRA Fall National Shoot here coming up in September. Check it out. Uh, you can learn more at nmlra.org, or you can check out some of my uh, photos and videos from past shoots at ilovemuzzleloading.com. Thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you next time.